Today, we're at Park Lake in Woolland, in Dorset. <laughs> Welcome to uh, the latest episode of Back of the Landing Net. Spring is here, um, so we thought we'd try our luck and try to get some bloody carp out here. Yeah, today we've come to Woolland Lakes, which is probably probably about four miles away from Mapana Lakes, which you would have seen on episode two. Um, yeah, spring's definitely in the air, lambs in the field, yeah, buds are on the trees, so hopefully the carp are chilling in the room. Yeah, well, you know, we're, the aim is to try and get a big one out today. Um, and you know, where, where better place to try and catch one when you're in the heart of Dorset countryside? So, uh, you know, Temple of Doom. If you've got a tree around the lake, it pays to climb up to the top of it to get a good view. Um, fish from above. And uh, I can see a fish down there now, it's paying off. I went out for a drink last night, had a kebab. Fish are in the water 24 7, so they're drinking all the time. Um, what do they fancy? Probably a kebab. So I've come up with this uh, nice little mixture of uh, sweet corn, pellet and sweet corn. Um, really, it helps to keep the pellet on there and uh, you know gives the fish a nice little treat. Just uh, strolling around the lake, um, just smelling each different area, trying to see if I can smell some fish. Let's see if we can get anything here. Yeah, there's a nice common down there. Um, there's no bream, but there has been in the last 10 minutes. Oh, there's some perch in there as well. Um, I think it's definitely worth having a go here. You've all heard of the old uh, special mints, fisherman's friend. Well, this is my fisherman's friend today. It's a bit of spam. Hoping to catch myself a nice big carp on this beauty. The belly on him. Oh, it's lovely fat bellied common. What do you reckon? About six? I'd say about six. Six. He's got a fat old belly on him, probably ready for spawning. Let's lift him back. <laughs> old Jay isn't one to rest on his laurels. He saw I caught a fish halfway down the lake. He's moved on down there. And uh, he's going to try the other end. Who is that girl? I don't know mate, but she's nicked your seat. Unbelievable, you walk down the lake, see how you're doing, somebody comes and sits in your seat. Unbelievable. Quite a slow day, um, but obviously Chris has had his nice carp out, um, which we're quite happy about. Um, I've shifted locations to try and uh, get the carp out for myself. So, oh, back of the landing net. Right, I haven't had a bite so far today, um, which sometimes can happen, you know, with all the, all the luck in the world, um, you can get days like that. But I don't want to go rusty. Um, I need to keep myself in shape, I need to keep myself fit and exercise just in case that bite does come along. So what I'm going to do is show you some tactics that I use personally to keep myself um, at 100% when I'm, when I'm next to the lake. No, I missed that one. So, have another go. Yep. Real, do the real. Nah, came off, came off. But you can you can see what I'm trying to do there is just, you know, get get everything get everything bloody loosened up, and uh, when the real one comes along, you know that you know you're pumped up and ready for it. That's what I do anyway. 
Right, that's it from us at Back of the Landing Net. Um, how would you describe today, Chris? Pants. That's a good description. I'll go along with that. Um, trying to think of why we've had such a bad day. Can you think of anything? Well, I think maybe pre spawning's kicking in. True, true. It's it is that time Yeah, yeah. We've never fished this lake before. Never been here before. To be so honest. we don't know how hard it is. It was quite hard. So, um, on that note, we'll see you next time on uh, Back of the Landing Net. <laughs>